Good morning and welcome to a weekly recap and trade plan for Apple. Um, haven't been able to take any new trades, been avoiding hurricanes, traveling, all this good stuff. So uh, nothing really done with Apple. This trade plan will be very, very simple. We are back into a very, very bullish setup in Apple in that price action. As I zoom in here, is above the 8 EMA, the blue line here, above the 21 EMA, above the 50 SMA, and the 200 SMA way down here. It's a very, very bullish setup, uh, both technically and algorithmically, and uh, should continue to be that way unless something drastic happens. I'm going to do my best to ignore the news stories that are coming out, simply because price action has not been following along with the fear that is coming out in the news. And as a result, I personally, I know I have missed a lot of opportunities that I've been watching, simply because there was that uncertainty. So... Uh, uncertainties out of the air. I'm going to continue to trade my strategies that I know that work for me and uh, really capitalize going into the end of the year. So anyways, I do want to see price action come up here as the initial target around this 221.30. I think it's 221.37 from this high right here up to about 224, 225, depending on how long it takes to get there. Uh, I expect to see some supply up in that area um, if I am able to take a swing trade. Now, if there is a breakout above this 215, this will simply be for uh, an intraday trade. I'll be in, take a breakout position, and then out as it goes up to uh, to profit. Um, I will also look for my algorithmic pullback triggers uh, for when those do occur, and also take those for a scalp. So uh, Apple will be at the top of my radar, and these are the levels and calls that I'm looking to buy at these levels. So we'll see what happens on Monday. Very simple, very quick, and uh, very easy trade plan for me for this week. If you have any questions or comments, please feel free to leave them down below. Have a good weekend, and good luck on Monday.